All right, so my first tip for editing faster is to use the Control K keyboard shortcut on Windows or Command K on Mac to make a cut at the time marker's current position. And this will cut all the selected tracks all the way down, so if you only want to cut a specific track, turn off all the other tracks over here before making the cut. Okay, and now since I only have that very first video track selected, Control K is only going to cut that first V1 track. My second tip is to use the C key on the keyboard to select the razor tool and the V key to select your selection tool. This will make editing much faster than using the toolbar on the side. My third tip is to use the up and down arrow keys on your keyboard to move the time marker between cuts. My fourth tip is to use the home key on your keyboard to move the time marker to the very beginning of your timeline and the end key to move it to the very end of the timeline. My fifth tip is for making quick duplicates. Simply hold down the Alt key on Windows or Option key on Mac while dragging any clip to make a duplicate of it. My sixth tip is all about quickly changing audio volume. Select any audio clip on your timeline and press the G key on your keyboard to bring up the gain pop-up. Now just enter a positive or negative value to increase or decrease your clip's volume. My seventh tip is on nudging a clip one frame at a time. To do this, select your clip you like to move, and I'm just going to zoom in a bit so you can see it moving. Now simply hold down the Alt key on Windows or Option key on Mac while using the left or right arrow keys to move your clip one frame at a time. Okay, and those are my seven tips for editing faster in Premiere Pro. Thanks for watching and see you next time.